Hey RVers, welcome to Southern Michigan at Richards Motor Sales RV Center. I'm Steve and I'll be your tour guide today. We have a new arrival, our best selling two bedroom single slide out trailer the last two calendar years. It's a Salem by Forest River 30 KQ BSS floor plan. And it's right on the fringe of half ton tow about 6,800 pounds. So the right half ton can tow this and it's really well equipped. Includes a swing around, bumper mounted, joins the camp kitchen, barbecue gas grill. Here's our outside kitchen with refrigerator, storage, outlets and hot and cold water plumbed in. They've also used a metal material for the counter as opposed to an MDF board or press board that wouldn't be as conducive to outside. Salem has multicolored LED lights. You can change the strobe or the fade or the color with a remote control. It's cool. And we have what's called the power package. So that really raises the value on a mid-level travel trailer by including a power front tongue jack with integrated camp light, 30 pound LP bottles in lieu of 20s, all LED lights inside and out, a big pass-through front luggage compartment, four push-button power stabilizer jacks, and of course a power patio awning with the multicolored LED lights inside. Here's pricing and um, I'll give you a tour inside. What's changed in the 30KQ BSS floor plan is primarily the front. So last year this was a dual entry bedroom with pocket doors. This year it's a three-quarter wall with an isolated side bedroom door on the right near the near the entry door and it'll accept a larger 40-inch range television and we have um, multimedia stereo system CD DVD here's our front master so when we have a three-quarter wall what has been added of great value is the two extra storage closets on the far right um, so instead of just having two shirt closets or wardrobes and some nightstands we now have additional storage in the master very valuable especially something that, that's 30 foot length we have a purpose built built-in laundry chute that can go to a basket down below a great way to manage dirty clothes and halfway through this last model year we started getting LG solid surface countertops which are a fantastic addition again to a mid-level travel trailer $20,000 range new changes we're starting to see is the high-rise pull-out sprayer uh, kitchen faucet really cool and that by doing the solid surface they're able to integrate uh, a split acrylic sink and we have stainless steel appliance package over here with two-way gas electric refrigerator range and oven microwave overheads with a split shelf and then purpose-built like our coachman in Salem do silverware drawer this comes with three remotes one is for the uh, patio awning LED light multicolored that we talked about one is for our stereo system so we have control that way and the third remote is um, must be in our prep package is a backup system nope they're starting to wall mount them now that's a great idea so the third remote is located near the entry door and it's a secondary way to extend and retract our stabilizer jacks our awning our power front jack up and down our slide out room in and out we can do it and spot it from outside on the off door side as well as outside activity lights so our one big slide out has uh, this is meadow decor so it's a very nice uh, leather with baseball stitching and a five cubic foot storage drawer below this sofa and then a mega booth family u dinette and we have a 38 inch full extension drawer below this dinette side so it'll certainly handle overflow pots and pans electric skillet 
and things we don't get at quite as often. Our side aisle bathroom has a foot pedal flush toilet, very nice vanity, uh, a little bit of valuable real estate to the left of the sink for appliances and hair dryers and such, and then a step in shower tub combo. As we make our way back to the uh, bedroom, on the immediate right is a pantry, so very, very, very important to have a nice pantry placed somewhere in reachability of the kitchen. And here's our back, remembering this is a single slide unit, the back kids room has sleeping for three. We have a fixed overhead bunk on the door or, or awning side, an integrated ladder, two nice storage cupboards, a lower dinette for the kids. We used to call this an eat and, eat and run dinette. It makes our third bed. And then overhead bunk that will um, lock up against the ceiling if we want it to for more dinette space down below. And Salem has finally converted over to the Teddy Bear brand uh, mattresses, which are a huge improvement. They're thicker and it's a velour material. They sleep better, last longer, and are more comfortable. Hey, there's a quick look at what $20,000 can buy you in a 2017 Salem 30K QBSS. I'm Steve with Richards Motor Sales RV Center, and thanks for your time.